Good afternoon. I'm Rob Johnson. Kate's off today. We begin with breaking news. A scary close call at Midway Airport between two passenger planes. Let's get right to Suzanne Lemigno. She's live in the newsroom with this breaking story. Suzanne. Rob, it's a close call because both planes were on runways that you see right here that intersect. And the FAA says each aircraft was able to stop more than 2,000 feet from the runway intersection. Listen closely. Southwest Flight 3828 is cleared for takeoff. Then all of a sudden, the air traffic controller yells to the pilot of Delta Flight 1328. Stop, stop. Jetwine.com publisher and commercial pilot Rob Mark says the runways both planes were on intersect, as you see in this animation. Just knowing that there were two aircraft of that size headed to the same intersection at the same time uh, is, is just, this could have been catastrophic. Air traffic control gives the Delta pilot directions on the runway, then says each pilot is speaking for the other. I make the right turn on to uh, taxiway Delta. Right turn to Delta, hold short runway four right. Expansion for each other. It's Southwest 3828 and Delta 1328. Then the Southwest pilot asks if he had in fact been cleared for takeoff. Southwest 3828. Yeah, for Southwest on 31 Center, were we the ones cleared for takeoff? Yes, sir, you were. You were the one. You were doing what you're supposed to be doing. And Delta took our uh, Delta was rolling also. He took, he took your call sign. Somebody kept stepping on you, and I couldn't figure out who it was. And then uh, well, that's why I reiterated that it was you that I was going to take off. Well, a Delta spokesperson says the airline is fully cooperating with the FAA's investigation. And Southwest says their pilots followed FAA air traffic control instructions and safely aborted takeoff. The airline also says safety is their number one priority. Live in the newsroom, Suzanne Lemigno, CBS 2 News. Rob. All right, Suzanne, thank you.